This week, the drivers of the NASCAR Xfinity Series take on one of the oldest services on the circuit as they head to the 1.5 mile Atlanta Motor Speedway. Daytona 500 winner Joey Logano would lead to field to green in the high sense 250, and it didn't take long for the field to go three wide racing. On lap eight, Jeffrey Earnhardt goes for a long slide through turn three and four, bringing out the first caution of the day. 46 laps in, these boys say we've had enough. Kyle Larson and many others start to hit pit road for much needed tires. Until today, Logano had never led a lap in Xfinity Series action at Atlanta, but he would lead the first 49 laps. From there, fellow Sprint Cup Series driver Kevin Harvick would take the point. Lap 85, a debris caution flies, bringing everyone down pit road, with only 10 cars remaining on the lead lap. Brian Scott would have restarted in the top five. However, he was penalized for having too many men over the wall. Now keep an eye when they roll the tire. Oh, there he is. See the guy? That's exactly what we were talking about. They stepped across the line to try and help out, and the new system caught him. Also, Elliott Sadler gets some damage after a run-in with John West Townley. With 48 laps to go, Sadler has to pit again to repair damage after a rough contact with Eric Jones off turn two, but a nice save by both drivers. 36 to go, and we have a battle for the lead. Logano reels in Harvick and goes back to the front. But a late race caution set up the last cycle of pit stops. Harvick beats Logano off pit road, placing them side by side on the restart. From there, Harvick holds off several strong charges from Logano, leading the final 27 laps en route to his fourth career NASCAR Xfinity Series win at Atlanta Motor Speedway. The part that makes me the most excited is just seeing the, the pit crew excel, seeing all the new guys on the race team that are, are coming to Victory Lane, that have been to Victory Lane a lot of times before, such as Dave, who's uh, you know come over to, to be the crew chief and to get his first win is, is, it makes me excited. Next up, NASCAR heads west for three straight weeks as the Xfinity Series heads to Las Vegas Motor Speedway. For NASCAR, I'm Nick Duncan.